Hey, this is Dave. Uh, we're in Colorado Springs. I come up here with my old buddy, butt plug, and we're up here for a little carbon show. We're trying to uh, get around and show you all what's happening. Well, welcome to the Wooden International Association of Wood Carbon Show. Okay, everybody. Uh, here we are today. It's September 23rd, 2023. Uh, we are at the Caricature Carvers of America Carving the Rocky Show out in Colorado Springs, Colorado. And I'm uh, going ahead and getting started a little bit early because uh, Ryan Elson is going to be going up on the screen here in a few minutes uh, to be announcing the winners. I'm going to try to capture that on the video. And um, he's going to tell us as far as uh, best show and some of the things that uh, that they've been doing as far as the, the awards go. I want to let you all know that I'm here with uh, my sidekick, Dave Levy. So finally, the two of us are together. First time. Uh, we've been working on this stuff for a while from different places, and uh, now we're finally together. So uh, it's a good thing. Um, I wanted to let you all know kind of some of the things that are coming up after this week, after we get back from Colorado. Uh, Rich Emily is going to be on next Saturday, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, he's going to be coming to us from the United Kingdom. Uh, so they're like five hours ahead of us, but he's still willing to come on. Uh, it'll be the same time, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And uh, he's going to do a demonstration um, of a Frankenstein. And uh, he's done the pattern and everything. So it should be a good meeting to join in on. Uh, just make sure that uh, that you join us. Uh, I'll try to provide the pattern and stuff for everybody after the meeting's over. Uh, after that, uh, Tom Wilkinson's going to be coming in on the 7th of October. Um, in, in October on the 14th, I'll be at the Severable Show. Uh, on the 21st, uh, Chucky Ducky Schutz going to be coming in with us. He's here today. Um, let's see, Ash and Brown from Badger State, State Blake are going to be coming in on October the 28th. And on November the 4th, I'll be down in Alabama at the Mid-South Wood Carving Show. So we've got a lot of stuff lined up. Uh, of course, you all know this is a CCA show. And uh, all of the uh, CCA guys that can come out uh, are here. Uh, Ryan Olson is getting ready to get started. So I'm going to go up front and I'm going to uh, let you all listen. So what we can have is, is I'll get through this fairly quickly if you can just give me your attention for just a second. Before I do... Um, Patrick Pelkey, when I'm done here, you just won the raffle for another uh, Dave Stetson uh, bus carving. And as soon as I'm done here, also the live carving demo um, with me, Kevin Applegate, is going to be starting up uh, about five minutes after I'm done with this presentation. And as soon as I'm done here as well, the, the showroom floor for the competition will be, will be open to you so that you can go see all of these incredible carvings we're, we're talking about. Um, we're just going to announce right now the winners of each category, and then we're going to announce the the um, best of show, the three best of show winners. If you are one of the best of show winners, we ask that you be here tomorrow at one o'clock um, so that we can get a photograph of you with the judges and with your carving. Um, for our for our promotional materials. So if you're best of show winner um, tomorrow at one o'clock, you can come back. First is um, our first category is our youth category, new category this year. Um, we're hoping this is going to expand. If you have if you have youth that you know that um, can enter a carving, bring it with you next year when you come. Our our winner of the youth category, and he won some great prizes. He won a, 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 a wood burner that was donated and a $500 check that was also donated. The winner of our youth category is Daxton Checkets. The winner of Christmas ornaments this year is Jeff Bailey. The winner of single human under 10 inches is Pete Zanaskis. And single human over 10 inches with this cowboy is Michael Chamberlain. The winner of our relief category this year with his Howlin' at the Moon was Bruce Futterer. The 
winner of our miscellaneous category this year went to Sarah Barraclough. And our bus category, the winner with his joker was Jeff Bailey. And um, miniature category, he's going to be walking away with some money this year, also went to Jeff Bailey. Um, or at least a lot of ribbons. The winner of our new category, this was a one year category. Um, just for this year, we had a bird, bird brain category. Can't wait for you to see these birds. The winner of the bird brain category this year was Rusty Johnson. A bottle stopper winner this year, Pat Moore. Our winner of the rough out category, Neil Sutherland. Group Animal, this year, the winner was Terry Moss. Single Animal by Sarah Barraclough. Santa Claus, Joe McMullen. Group Mix, Sarah Barraclough. Group Human, the winner was Terry Moss. Now the best of show, um, these winners were chosen from the winners of each of those categories. So in order to be eligible for the best of show, um, you, um, you had to have won your category. These, um, before actually, before I announce this, we'd like to thank our judges this year. They were in there, it, they, they poured through each and every carving and did an incredible job. Judging. We'd like to thank our three judges this year, um, Dwayne Gosnell, and yeah, and Bob Hershey, and, and Radical Floyd Radigan were our judges this year. They did a great job, and we want to thank them. Now, the judges for the Best of Show were all the CCA members, so they all um, went in and judged. So this, if you want Best of Show, this was saying that that. All the CACA members loved your carving and 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 thought you deserved um, a little something extra. All right, third best of show this year with his bird brain goes to Rusty Johnson. Are you here, Rusty? Rusty here. Second best of show with his airplane scene prepare for departure goes to Terry Moss. And this year, our best of show with her hello neighbor goes to Sarah Barraclough. Congratulate these carvers if you see them. Um, and the uh, and the carving uh, the competition is is now open. And so head in and look at some of these carvings and and, uh, and enjoy yourself. All right, guys. There's the winner of the competition. Hopefully you all can see that. I'm not sure if we're having uh, any kind of difficulties on our end, um, but seems as though Sarah Bearclaw has taken home the best to show and we'll get her right there. If you'll say hello, there she is. There's Bruce Ankeny, Dave Stetson sitting up over here. Going to uh, see if we can pass it over to Dave Stetson, and he's going to go around and show you some of the exhibits and things that are showing up here. While we're getting Dave on, I'll just uh, kind of pan around the room. Y'all can see it's a big turnout, um, quite a bit of uh, carvings and vendors, um, all kinds of stuff here today. So, Dave, if we can go ahead and turn it over to you. There you go. There you are, Dave. All right, this is Sarah Bearclaw. <laughs> you want to do it again? Take two. All right. It's better the second time around. Sure. Tell us about your best show winner. 
So it's hello neighbor. It's Mr. Rogers and Officer Clemens when they will put their feet in a little swimming pool. Mr. Rogers was, I think, proving a point and that's always been a very significant thing for me. So yeah, I carved it and totally unexpected. Didn't expect that at all. Thanks, Sarah. Yeah. Mr. Bruce Ankeny sitting next to Sarah. Bruce is one of our newer members of the Character Carvers of America. What do you think of that, Bruce? Well, it's a little bit overwhelming. He's right. so excited. Well, it's pretty exciting and it's quite an honor. Yeah, we're pretty overwhelmed too. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna to be tough for me to get out of here because I'm gonna to have to step around, Mr. Hankney. <laughs> but- uh, Thanks, Dave. Thanks, Bruce. Dave, you don't get much airtime. Um, yeah, no, I'm just- Dave Levy hitting the operation board here. And we're gonna pan around the room and find some people to talk to. So this is caricature carving in the Rockies, the caricature carvers of America show and competition, and all the other good things. We have classes going on here. We got uh, Mr. PJ Driscoll, who's given us a, a poop eaten grin because he's Embarrassed to be online. PJ, you want to tell us real quick about your class? Okay, that's enough, PJ. Thank you. Actually, um, isn't his name Pajamas? You guys that are sitting here in PJ's class, what do you think he's job he's doing? Does he know what he's talking about? Don't all speak at once. He appears to know what he's talking about. He appears to know what he's talking about. Well, that remains to be seen. Thanks, PJ. Good job. Wayne Laramore teaching another class over here right now. He's really involved in what he's doing. He's not aware of the world around him. Yes, I am, Dave. So uh, we're going to try to squeeze on by. Thanks, Wayne. Let letting us disturb you. We're gonna we're gonna drift off to the cables that are set up. This happens to be the front row of tables, the International Association of Wood Carvers and the Wood Carving Academy side by side. Moving on to PJ Driscoll, who you just met teaching a class behind me. And who have we got here? This Dale Green. Uh, Salt Lake City, Utah. This is a sale table for t-shirts, merchandise, books, hats, pins, buttons, all kinds of crap you can't live without. And Carrie Green, Dale's wife, operating the table with Mitch Cartledge. Hello, Mitch. Hey, Dave. You're from Morgantown, North Carolina. Yep. That's why he talks funny. <laughs> I don't talk funny, you do. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to slide down the next row of tables here, see what's going on. We're just going to squeeze our way in and around people. This is a car Cajun caricature wood carver, Tommy Granger. Some of you know Tommy. Tommy's usually participating. This is the gal that whenever they raffle a knife off, she always gets in the biggest bid. I don't know how she does that, but uh, yeah, just a little short blonde lady I met for the first time. I'm not sure whose table this is. Looks like it's just an overflow. Now we're moving into tool arm wood carvings. This is the work of Kevin Applegate, CCA member. That's his wife sitting back there behind the table. And we go over here to the table of Mr. Bruce Ankeny, who we can now say is also a CCA member. Where are you getting a lot of airtime here, Bruce? Wow. I'm embarrassed. You don't know how shy I am. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, here we have more wood products and rough outs. Yeah. 
And boy, all you woodcarvers can just drool your little heart out. So you got the finest supply of basswood going. By that, they do rough outs. Randy Moore, Chief Executive Officer, Moore, rough outs. This is going out to the world. Oh, this is Facebook. Oh, This isn't Facebook. This is the International Association of Woodcarvers. Okay. So you want to say hello to the rest of the world? Well, hello to the rest of the world. All right. Thank you. Some of the rough outs they've got up here. Not only basswood, but butternut. And it goes on and on and on. And if you travel here by air, you're screwed because you can't get it all in your bags. But you can order and they ship. Also some really nice cottonwood bark. Thick stuff. Nancy with her sharpeners. Some people would rather not talk to me. I can't take you in here to show you what's going on because that happens to be the women's restroom. But if I turn around, here's a display table for our newest CCA members. We'll get back to the carvings for the rest of them in a little bit. There's something's going on tonight. Cat sponsored by Cavender's Boot City, Ugly Cowboy Carving Contest. This is a plaque. It's going to get somebody's name on it. And here's a big fat check. And boy, I'd like to see my name on there. Rich Smithson, Healthy Knives, and his cohort. The brains of the afternoon, Ducky. Come by tonight. Ducky's usually on here with the little square with his beard sticking in it. <laughs> but the real Ducky is, he, he looks better in the little square. May not be recognized because I have sleeves on. And there's no holes in it. No shirt. He's got a shirt without a hole in it. But all of you nice guys can eat your heart out if you're not here. So, beautiful Dave Stetson there's a, knives here. Dave Stetson oh, look at that. Nice, nice. Look at these, look at these tools. A wood carver's dream. Whoops. Look at these, look at these fancy hands. That's the ducky knife. And then we have mountain wood carvers from Estes Park. Set up as vendor with everything you could need for wood carving. And it goes on down. That's Pam and Skyler, mountain wood carvers. And we get another aisle coming up. Mike's Peak Whittlers, local group. Thank them for sharing their fine city with us. Don Schwartz, Pennsylvania boy. Oh, look, he's selling knives too. This is my first chance to walk around and see what the heck's going on here. Oh, here's a copy of the latest and greatest. Character Carvers of America, pick your nose and carve it. So this is Don's copy of the book, I'm guessing. Can I just flip through? Yeah, you bet. I'll get you to sign it after a while. I'll come back and do that later. Everything you'd want to know about carving the nose and a lot of things you don't want to know about. All right, Roger Stiegel and his rough outs and say hello, Roger. Don't wave to me, wave to the audience. Thank you, Dave. We got a, we got a, we got a hundred thousand people on today. Okay. I'm exaggerating. All right. I know there's not that many of you, but I don't I don't know how many there are. 
Whoa, look at this. A Texan showed up in Colorado. Who'd have thought? Texas still thinks they own Colorado. That's right, we do. So we're just kind of going around for the International Association of Woodcarvers showing people what's going on. I think I keep getting my finger in front of the camera. Hey, Dave. Listen. Yes, sir. If you want to make your way into the uh, the awards uh, so you can show some of the carvings from in there, I'll uh, Will take do. time to show what's up here on the stage with all the uh, CCA members, uh, all the all carvings right. they put up here. If you want to make your way in there. This is another Texas table. It's Texans. They kind of hang together. Thanks, Blake. All right. I'll just wander away. Okay. All right, guys. I'm up here on the stage. Um, we're going to let Dave take time to go in and uh, get to where the awards are. Uh, the CCA every year has uh, their members come in and bring some of their works in so that uh, people can see a sample of kind of what they've done. So I'm going to. I'm going to turn my camera around and kind of take you around this room and show you that. Um, and you'll see there's founding members of the CCA from uh, 1990. You got uh, carvings from Bob Travis here. Floyd Radigan. Good to see you, my friend. You got Jim Heiser. A drawing class with you. I'm cool. I really screwed him up. Carol Levy. <laughs> oh, that's great. Starvings from PJ like, Driscoll. Up there doing the stage. Vegas guy turns it back over to me and I'll do the starving. Uh, I might just stay here and start with you. We got Kevin Applegate. I'm Max Cartledge. Because you're his boss. Right. Oh. Del Green. Dave Levy, you need to mute everybody that's not. Uh, Blake. Yeah, let me see if I can get that taken care of here real quick. We apologize for this. This is kind of on the fly. All right, let's see if this works. You got Dale Green's carving here. Got some carvings from Ryan Olson. There's a one of a kind carving the Rockies heavy knife that Rich Miss and Burnt. Some carvings from Dave Stetson. And this looks to be early carvings. So the bottom ones are the early carvings and then the top ones are current carvings. Rich Weatherby. There's Bruce Hinn. Mr. Chris Hammett. Bob Thurston, Wayne Larimore, Dwayne Gosnell, Joe Yu, Dennis Thornton, and Bob Hershey. So it's pretty cool that they've uh, they've all brought pieces uh, that were maybe some of the earliest stuff so that you can see uh, the progress there and how far they've, they've all come as far as uh, from the beginning when they first started carving uh, to what they're doing now. So uh, pretty neat up here. Again, a lot of people, I'm up on the stage, so I'm gonna turn the camera around. You can kind of see the size of the room. A lot of people here today, there's classes going on. You got demonstrations going on over in the corner. If you've never been here, you really need to take the opportunity uh, to try to come to Colorado Springs for one of these shows and um, and take all of this in. You know, if you want to buy, you want to buy, you know, rough outs, if you want to get wood, if you want to buy knives, this is really a great opportunity to be able to do that. So I'm, uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn this over to Dave Stetson and uh, see if we can get it back to him. right here. I'm not going to carve a mount on this. And I'm not going to carve a mount because two reasons. Number one, you don't need it. And number two, you can do them a whole lot quicker if you're production carving them like I do sometimes. That mount in the next uh, 10 or 15 minutes 
Yeah, I could be moved on to the next one. So I'll look for you at home. I don't much of it for money, but I don't make myself work too hard when I do this night too. Kevin, we're filming you for the International Association of Wicked Cars. Well, I'm sorry for them. Thanks, though. So if you, want, <laughs> if you want to say hi and continue on, we'll try not to bother you. You're not bothering me. Thanks, folks. So this is body on. The vehicles, for me, the angle of the vehicle matter. Uh, and we're heading in toward the wood carving competition. And my next interviewee snuck off on me. Ladies, would you hey. like to say hi to the American public? Hello. We're watching you on International Association of Wood Carvers, and you can find yourselves on YouTube. Oh, yeah. There he is, Mr. Heiser. Howdy, folks. We'll start right down here with him, red shoelaces, <laughs> and we'll work our way up to the important part. Now you've all had a good chuckle. Hey, I hope that's tickled everybody. We're having out here at our second annual show. It's been a great day, National Character Carving Day. So if you're not with us, I hope you're home carving well after the show. So, so Jim, you want to tell people why you're all decorated like this? Well, uh, according to Chris Hammock, I'm the master of ceremonies. So, uh, we're, we're going to go with that. It's better than the story I've been telling everybody else. All right. Thanks, Jim. Sure. And here's a competition. And I'm looking for Mr. Olson to guide me around. Here's some of the folks that are in here walking around looking. We have Paul and Terry Volpe here from Reno. You folks know these folks, but uh, Paul is one of the greatest organizers of wood carving in the Reno area. Says so right there on his shirt, Reno yeah. wood carvers. <laughs> and he would be nothing without this fine lady <laughs> by his side. It's true. Thanks, Is there anything you'd like to say or are you embarrassed enough? I'm embarrassed enough. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Right, I'm embarrassed enough. <laughs> You're in a wonderful world. Thank you, world Paul. Here. You want us to go find, find Ryan? Uh, if you see him, send him this way. Okay. I'll start talking as best I can to explain what we're seeing. This is our best to show. Sarah Barclaw. We started the episode with her this, morning, this afternoon. So me and you talk. So this is something she did from Mr. Rogers. I like so that's Mr. Rogers and Officer Clemens sharing a swimming pool. Second runner-up, Dave Dion. Like a salmon, he's very as a group of folks this in an airplane, right here, all sorts of three times wider than this. Yeah, so it's like it's it's so it's yeah, the wider didn't help, you should have went forward because Santa, you want to think this is a bird one. brain, a new category um, we had this year. The, the more fat baby he gives, the more he looks like a jolly Santa. Now, I didn't come up with that fat baby scenario. Mr. Dwayne I mean, Gosnell talked to some folks. Beside me, this uh, filming did. Perhaps I'm doing some critiques. Most of fat baby. Oops. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Excuse me. All of some of that stuff. Just, you know. So, this is the Santa Claus category. Single Are you going back to the <laughs> I'm probably going backwards. Like said, okay. a lot of times it's hard Would you like to There's say a few a words to the folks people. watching the International Association of Wood Carvers? Hey, we're having a good time here. This is Debbie, what's her name, from Bishop, <laughs> California. <laughs> yes. This is amazing. Did you put anything in? No, 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 no. As far as the execution, oh, I love you. No, I'm just, just one of the organizers. That's why. I don't know how to do it. Everything you got going. Rough out categories. Scrap the pattern they have. And what I mean by that is you can't, if something's wrong with the pattern, you can't elongate it one way or the other. And bottle stopper categories. Excuse me, Alan. This more so. <laughs> oh, that was pretty wild. It's just a fishtail. That would be some big water coming out of the bottle. There's a guy squeezing out of the bottle. The creativity of the pieces this year are, I don't want to say they're mind blowing, but they're pretty damn good. I've never been to one of these before. You've never been here before? What do you think? I think it's incredible. This is a 
unsolicited. Well, no, I'm soliciting her right now. Oh. <laughs> but this is a nice lady who's commenting on the show as she's walking through yes. and seeing these wood carvings for the first time. Yes. Wow. Excuse me, I'm going the wrong way. Yeah. That's just because yeah. I can't get the crowd to move fast enough for me. Are you doing anything, man? Excuse me, sir. Can you step right around me? All right, we have a chest set here. A bowl of cereal. Now, oh, wait a minute. What the hell is going on? It's a Fruit Loop and a bowl of Cheerios and there's little eyeballs on them. So, milk spilled all over. Okay. Creativity. Some pieces you may or may. This is more of the relief carving care and caricature. So. <laughs> Sorry, we haven't got Ryan to guide you, guide us along. Cowboy Kent, single human figure, ten inches and over. It's a pretty big piece here. The infallible golf. So it's the Pope. Blue ribbon. So if you've seen any ideas here that strike your fancy, hopefully it'll uh, encourage you to carve and create pieces that you can enter into competitions. Start out with big We're coming on down to the youth category. And this young guy is going to win a wood bar. Along with some cash. I just took pictures of that because this is Tom Checkett's son, grandson. Yeah. And when Tom could be here, Dexter could be here. But this kid's gonna start a car a few years ago. And he's he, when I met him, he goes, Oh my god, I'm so happy to see you because I do videos, and that's what he's been following. This kid's son of 12 years old, so he's doing carvings like this, blue ribbon. So I'm, I was texting Tom to let him know this is what your grandson did. So this is Eric Owens talking about this young man who did this carving. That's cool. Thanks, Eric. Thanks, Dave. All right, we, uh, we're back out here in front of the, uh, the tables where they're doing some of the classes. And uh, we'll walk back here again. Yeah. For CCA member, uh -huh. we'll do the same thing with Blake and yes. say something before we close out okay. on this one. Absolutely. So I was saving the best for last year. I know. know. Yeah. That was my wife talking to Dave there. She's uh she's enjoying her time out here as well. And I'm trying to get my computer fixed. There we go. So um, just wanted to remind you all this is uh this is going to be an annual show out here in Colorado Springs. This is the second show they had one last year at the same time. And if you want to go out and see about that show, you can go out on uh, the International Association of Woodcarvers uh, YouTube page. And uh, you'll be able to see the video there. This video is going to be posted out uh, probably when we get back. Uh, I won't be back in town until after Tuesday. So maybe midweek uh, before we're able to do that. Um, but we'll, we'll render the video. We'll get it ready. And that way people can go out and look. And I would say go ahead and make arrangements to try to be here next year. Uh, again, there's a little expense to it. But this is the only opportunity to have all of the CCA guys um, in one place. And also this is the only caricature show that's devoted strictly to caricature in the United States. So this is the only place that you'll be able to come and see just caricature carving. So, uh, try to come out if you can. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn this over to my wife and let her handle this. How about that? So I'm here with Dave. Photobomb. <laughs> 
we're uh, we're having a good time, guys. You are missing out. Y'all know Blake. Thanks, brother. It's a big honor for me. I appreciate it so much. The honor is all ours. I appreciate it. Guys, uh, CCA, this is where it's at. We need to try to get out here if we can. Just like I said a few minutes ago, International Association Wood Carvers tries to share this with you all uh, so that maybe you'll make the trip. So try to come next year to be around the same time. As soon as I find out the dates, I'll let you know. Uh, this has been the International Association of Wood Carvers. Uh, we appreciate you all joining us out here in Colorado Springs for the second annual Carbon the Rocky Show. So thank you all. We'll see you soon. Yeah. Let me know when you're ready because I'm going to try to spit water. Well, you're already uh, recording, so whenever you want to spit. Both the International Association of Woodcarvers. Did I forget to say that? Yeah, but we can add it in if you want to say it now. Oh.